In its native country of Hungary, the Schlaas were traditionally used as hunting and working dogs. Also known as Hungarian pointers, they are one of the friendliest and most affectionate of all dogs, which makes them very suitable as family pets. History and Origin of the Vishla During the 9th and 10th centuries, the Magyars brought the ancestors of the Hungarian Vishla from Asia to the Carpathian Basin, which lies on the territory of today's Hungary. The dogs are mentioned in documents from as far back as the 14th century. Since the 18th century, Vishlas were primarily used as hunting dogs, but over the years they were increasingly replaced by setters and other pointing dogs. It was only at the beginning of the 20th century that the dog breed was recalled, and in 1920 the Hungarian Vishla Breeders Association was founded. Vishlas became very popular in the USA after the Second World War. While at first only a short head variety of the dog existed, later a wire head variety was created by crossing a Vishla with a German wire head pointer. Today the wire head Vishla is classified by the FCI as a separate breed. Appearance of the Vishla According to the breed standard, Males should have a height at the withers of 58 to 64 cm, while females should have a slightly smaller height of 54 to 60 cm. The weight is not fixed and is between 18 to 30 kilos, depending on the sex. Their life expectancy is around 12 to 15 years. The dogs have a muscular body, which is narrow and almost dainty looking. Depending on the breed, the fur can be short or wire-haired. The coat color varies in shades from bread yellow to dark gold. Small white markings on the throat, chest or toes are allowed, but a spotted coat is not permitted according to the breeding standard. Short-haired Vishlas have no undercoat and are therefore somewhat sensitive to cold temperatures. The dog's rounded ears hang down close to their skull and they carry their tail, which reaches to the hock horizontally. Temperament and training of the Vishla The dogs are very active and require a lot of challenges and exercise. They have a lot of stamina and are affectionate, obedient and cuddly. Because they are curious, playful and willing to learn, they are good with children and sometimes they can be very protective of them. Vishlas are quite sensitive and when stressed, they can become nervous. Therefore, they need a lot of empathy and care in their training. The dogs have excellent hearing and will react to their owner's commands with silent gestures and facial expressions alone. They should never be kept in a kennel and are not suitable purely as guard dogs. Sometimes, if they are not given enough tasks, they can develop behavioral problems. Since Vishlas are fast, persistent and like to retrieve, they can be used as bloodhounds. They also make good rescue dogs. Exercise and care of the Vishla Short walks are not enough for Vishlas. They need lots of exercise and plenty of opportunities to run freely. If they are not used for hunting, then dog sports such as man trailing, trekking or agility courses can be a good substitute. They also love playing in water. In some dogs, the disease Vishla myositis can occur. This is a weakening of the dog's bite muscles, which can lead to swallowing difficulties and vomiting. Hip dysplasia is quite rare in the breed. Thanks to their short coat, their grooming regime is quite easy. Any dirt in their coat can be rubbed off with a towel. It is also a good idea to regularly check their sensitive ears.